our message here today is help is on the way to the people who have suffered in Texas and Louisiana and to say thank you to all the first responders, to say thank you to our president who personally donated $1 million of his own money to help the people of Texas and Louisiana, to say thank you to our leadership. Mr. Speaker, thank you for bringing this bill to the floor so quickly. Uh, Mr. Leader, Mr. Leader, to come to Houston, we spent time together flying over the flood-ravaged areas. And, Kathy, we are so grateful, all of us in Texas and Louisiana, for the immediate response of the Congress, for the immediate response of the American people. Uh, we are today uh, going to pass legislation in the House that will provide an immediate cash infusion to help the victims recover to help them with hotel expenses, with all the other things that uh, they did not anticipate two, three weeks ago. Their lives were transformed in a moment. This uh, scale of the flooding is, uh, is unimaginable. My family's lost everything. My, my brother lost his home. They've been utterly destroyed. My, all my in-laws have lost everything. The entire city of 70% uh, of, of Houston and Harris County was underwater. The entire city of Orange and Port Arthur was underwater at some point. Uh, the rain just wouldn't stop. I spent all last week out in neighborhoods helping rescue people, uh, boats and using boats and trucks uh, and waders to pull people out of homes. And the uh, scale of the tragedy is unimaginable. But in the midst of all this and all the suffering, uh, it really reflects the American character, how people from all over the country stepped up to help uh, Houstonians recover from this. In the neighborhoods last Saturday, I met a team of four guys with a boat who, uh, from Florida who simply got in their car, in their truck, and drove the boat to Houston to help pull people out. And a guy from Michigan was out in the neighborhoods. We had, during the midst of the storm, on the second day when it was just, it just was catastrophic flooding, uh, I got a phone call from Garrett Graves of Louisiana who said, the Cajun Navy wants to come help Houston. I didn't even know there was such a thing. Uh, 110 trucks just spontaneously got together, pulling 100 boats from central Louisiana, carrying thousands of meals of jambalaya and red beans and rice and diapers and water and radios. Help is on the way. Help is on the way, America, because Congress knows this is an emergency. We are acting decisively. There are no Democrats. There are no Republicans. There are no party divisions. We are all Americans here today to make sure that the people who suffered the most get the help the quickest. And we're deeply, deeply grateful to all of the people of America who stepped up to help us and thankful for the, Republic, for the leadership of the Congress working together arm in arm, regardless of party, to help us recover from this disastrous storm. Thank you very much.